Hey guys, so I just got my glam bag for this month and I thought I would share with you what's in it because I do that every month. And I apologize for my lighting. I have new lights and I'm also at home at my parents' house. And for some reason the lights are making me look gray and I'm doing my best to try and figure out how to counter that. But for right now this is the best I could do. So I'm going to go ahead and jump into the bag. So, Apparently not enough people were like buying the Just Fab things with the coupon codes that were being sent so now they have like an entire book trying to sell us shoes from there so that is in there along with the $20 off coupon code thing and then there's the little card with everything that's in it and it says from Ipsy with love so I'm assuming that's the theme I don't even know if they theme these anymore and then there's a glam bag gift subscription now available thing. So they've kind of started to ruin the surprises for the glam bags. They're posting everything that's in them before, well before they get shipped, at least a lot well before I get mine. And it's a little disappointing to me because I kind of liked the surprise. So this is the bag. It's kind of uh, bulkier. It's not, I don't know how to explain it, it's wider than the other bags, but it's also a little bit shorter. So the first thing I got in here, and I got this, I got an email when I got my tracking number that said I was gonna have this in here, and it's an exclusive review. There's this little card in here and says, we recognize you as a trusted influencer within the Ipsy community, and I think it's for anyone that's posted anything on their little like Ipsy blog kind of deal. And um, it's a special gift, Naked Skin Beauty Balm by Urban Decay product is so new it hasn't even hit shelves yet and we want you to be the first to try it. Are you a blogger, YouTuber, creative, hipster, blah 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 blah. Uh, try the sample and share your thoughts. So they put that in here and it's just Urban Decay's BB Cream. It's supposed to come out in January. And it's a very very tiny um, sample so I really don't even see how I can get too much uh, of an idea of what it's like out of here. But yes, it's a very, very tiny tube of Naked Skin by Urban Decay, and there is no color on here, so I'm assuming it must come with in one color. I just ran out of my um, BB cream in the pink, I can't even think of the brand right now, but this is an American BB cream, so I haven't tried any of those yet, so I'm kind of excited to see how different this is. So there's this. Then the next thing in here is an Urban Decay 24-7 pencil in zero. Um, this I believe, I got a purple one of these before, a purple that I already had the full size of, so I gave it away. I'll keep this one because I go through black eyeliner pretty quickly. Um, and this is just Urban Decay's black eyeliner pencil, and it's a little sample size The one. next thing in here is a NYX Ultra Pearl Mania pigment. Mine is the black one, it's in black pearl, and it's just a black with some shimmer. I already have this exact color. So I'll probably give this to my mom since I'm home. So I'm not going to open this to swatch it or anything, but it's just a shimmery black eyeshadow pigment. And yeah, I'm going to just give that to my mom because I already have this color. I will say though, I've been with My Glam since last January, and I think those are the, the Urban Decay Pencil and that NYX pigment are the only two times that I've ever actually had a repeat product. So the next thing in here is this, and it's a Mirabella um, face and eye primer, which I can't get out of the box. Mirabelle Prime for eyes and face. And it looks like this. Now, for me, the things that I want in an eye primer are different than the things I want in a face primer, so I'm not positive how I'm going to feel about something that's supposed to be used for both. It's clear. And it's just a very silicone-y kind of uh, thing. It feels like my face primers. It feels like what I want, like in my face primer. So I'll probably most likely use this for my face and not so much for my eyes. Um, I'm sure it would work fine for the eyes, but just for me, I don't like that silicone-y feeling on my eyelids. So there's that in there. The next thing is my Couture highlighting sheets. I haven't looked at these yet. I know the last, the glam bag from last year, the December bag, um, had blush sheets in it, but I wasn't a subscriber back then. So I never got to try those. And there's a little thing in here that says how to highlight. And there's actually a lot of sheets in here. Just like a peachy toned kind of highlighter on a sheet. So 
I don't see how this could be any more convenient than just a powder highlighter, to be honest with you. I think I'd prefer a powder highlighter. Highlighter. I feel like this could get kind of messy, um, hitting it places on your face where you don't really want it. But, you know, teach their own. And the very last thing that I got in here is Be A Bombshell Lip Gloss in Hot Mess. And I have the liquid lipstick that we got a couple bags back. It was a really dark red. That was from Be A Bombshell. And if I recall correctly, the things are kind of expensive. So this is nice to be in here. I'll have to look up the full size, but I'm pretty sure that liquid lipstick that we got was like $18 full size or something like that. And this is a very, very bright red lip gloss. It looks like it'll be a little bit sheer. It's got a doe foot applicator. And yeah, it's a little bit sheer, but it's still really bright and you're still going to get a lot of color. It's got a little bit of a strange smell, but it's not... It's kind of sticky, but it's not like super, super sticky. That's for me, though, because I actually don't really mind sticky lip glosses, so... For me, not sticky might be very different than not sticky for someone else, so there's that. But yeah, that's it. The inside of the bag is pink and has Ipsy printed all over it. My entire Ipsy Glam bag for the month of December. I hope you guys like this, and I will talk to you later. Bye!